I'm going to give you 10 design thinking models. A complete overview. Now, number 10 is a special one. The relatively unknown fantastic E6 design thinking model. And what's the bonus model? Combining business thinking with design thinking. Let's start straight away. The 3i model of IDEO. IDEO is a renowned international design firm founded by David Kelly in 2008. Their 3i model covers the essence of design thinking. Inspiration to understand people. Ideation to generate ideas. And implementation. The five-phase model of the Hassel Platner Institute of Design at Stanford University. You recognize the three phases of IDEO in the five-phase model of the renowned D School at Stanford University. Empathize, define, ideate, prototype and test. The Google Design Sprint. Here's a model with the same steps but then all implemented in a week. Yes, in five days actually. It's the Design Sprint developed by Jay Knapp at Google in 2010. The Austin Center of Design uses also a three-step model. Ethnography, synthesis and prototyping. The DEEP design thinking model is a four-phase acronym, which stands for Discover, Empathize, Experiment and Produce, developed by Mary Cantwell. The German ERP firm SAP uses a five-step model for user-centered design, as they call it. Plan, research, design, adapt and measure. New here is the measure aspect, which I really love, as facts form the basis from which to pivot your idea into something better. The British Design Council introduced a so-called a double diamond of four divergent and convergent phases. Understand, define, explore and create. The design thinking process of the D School in Paris-Est. The three steps of the design thinking process are worked out into nine sub-steps, which makes it very detailed. A plus of this model is that it stresses that design thinking is something iterative of inspiration, ideation and implementation. Over time, design thinking models got even tailor-made for special purposes or for special branches. I love this model here, which was specially visualized to teach design thinking at schools by Maker's Empire. Bravo! The until now relatively unknown E6 model for design thinking, developed between 2012 and 2015, I can really recommend to you. Why? First of all, the six-step model makes sense and is different than a lot of earlier models which are mostly copycats. Secondly, Katja Chimol of Mindshack made a complete free accessible toolkit with a lot of techniques per phase you might use, depending on your type of challenge. On our website, mindshake.pt, you can download all the templates. Link is in the description. The bonus model is the fourth innovation methodology, which I founded myself in 2005. The strength of this methodology is that it's a structured approach which combines business thinking with design thinking and back to business thinking. It's an inspiring expedition map. Now watch this movie here to learn all about this methodology, which will double your innovation effectiveness.